against Tubby Smith of Georgia. Doing a phenomenal job there. He's lost five starters, Tubby Smith. And the Wildcats are going to a full point lead. 10-16 to go. Brent, you're going to love Anderson. He's going to play at the next level. He's a tremendous second guard prospect. He can really run, jump, shoot, the perimeter shot. Carter comes in and replaces Smith. Smith will take a break. This is the one area where Miss cannot make a mistake, and they must hit their free throws when they get an opportunity if they expect to stay close with Kentucky. Whenever you're the other guard, you've got to take special situations and handle them well. That means attack. I've got so many players, they can run at you. A kid like Edwards, but he's patient and willing to get his plans on, helping in any way he can. Back to the zone. If I were Miss, I would like that they stay in that zone. He ships it on in now to CSA. players in America. Turner, big rebounder. Anderson over the top. They're not really close that time. Defensive transition is going to really be important for all this. Only left hand. Right. Oh, 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 nobody rotated over. Kentucky looks a little bit lethargic right now. Nails the two throws. 24-23. We're coming down to the four and a half minute mark here. The first half in Oxford. White, who hit a couple of Sends it, Darby, Darby fires it. Three, he can shoot the three now. He was two for 12, but you don't shoot 47% going into that Alabama game and not be able to tickle the twine. NBA, nothing but nylon by Six Darby. of 12 from three-point land. Kentucky has not hit one three-point shot. Boom, boom, to save it back into the hands of White. 12 on the shot. Darby fires it. A three. Mr. Belton, uh, did I call Mr. Darby before he came in the game? I said, you go back and look at the tape. I said, one of the most important players will be coming off the bench, and his name is Josiah Darby. It's 8.43. Wildcats come back down. Mercer on the floor with Epps. Kentucky went in a one spurt. They have gotten a little quiet. They got to pick it up now. Every possession, you never think that Epps going to hold. Out on Darby. You don't want to stop the clock. There's offensive tackle. Oh, about great play guard. Great play guard. It's excited right now. Sends it back to White on top. White's going to take some seconds down off that clock. He's going to bring it down inside of 20 now. It's only a six point lead. Ole Miss must still continue to play. Here's Cissé. He's been extremely. Oh, nice entry. Into Boone on the entry. And he goes high. Look at that. Turn around. Nice entry. Good two man ball. They go to Billy going and making a couple of threes. Well, we got the biggest upset right now in Mississippi history in college basketball. But with the shot clock coming down to about 20 seconds left, Cisse, nobody open down on the inside. So Ole Miss is stuck out on the perimeter right now. With a shot clock, Darby finally penetrates on the dribble. Darby hits boom. Huge moment for Ole Miss. I'll tell you, Greg, nothing like dribble penetration. Get into the scene. They're not as as they are with Anderson on the floor. I'll tell you, this is getting to danger time right now for the Cats. And his crowd smells it. It's eight right now at 6.35. That's the number we're sitting on. They need to stop right now. I'd go to C-Set. I'd go to C-Set. I'd get him the ball one-on-one. -on -one. Got it into his hands now, Dick. He's doubled up. He wasn't one-on-one -on -one behind. Came to him today. Uh -oh. Derby. Uh -oh. Fake. Uh -oh. Two uh -oh. shots. the 
Live right now, the dribble penetration. See how you break the defense down? You draw the DD, you drop it off. The three D man. You drive, you draw, the dish the rod, and then you watch it develop. You take the picture, you say, coach. He's on the floor, Boone is off. Only comes in. Only at Darby. Darby is the player you want to put the ball in his hands right now. Well, Kentucky going to face guard, make it very tough to get that ball in down. 6.8 seconds. Turner replaces Epps defensively. He'll take White. You want to put the ball basically towards your basket. It is. They got Darby. Mercer calls him, and here he comes. Blue Joe's White. on Darby, Blue and he White. can't wait to get to the free throw. Yeah, look at him. He's on a hurry. He's coming to get there. I'm going to make the. I like that confidence. Give me the rock, he says. Let's go. Let me end this drama. Let me end all this drama, he's saying. I'm draining these two, and there's no four-point play. All the Kentucky people back home are right now crossing their fingers, crossing their toes, hoping for Brick City, USA. I hope he can make for one of the greatest nights in recent memory in Oxford, Mississippi. If he can make a piece of oh, free throw part. Look at Rick Pitino. Can't believe it. I'll tell you, he coaches every ounce of energy of his body on that sideline. Gives everything up. Inspires and fusses guts. But what an effort today by his old this kid. A 14-game Kentucky win streak on the line. Joe Zahn Darby Jr. from Jackson, Mississippi, nails the first one. 23 to row they have in the SEC. A regular season game, not counting the loss we had last year in the tournament. But this is